and the person responsible was Manikin Begin. And it was the biggest terrorist attack against the history of British mandate in which 91 people were killed. And at that time, Manikin Begin, he was called as terrorist number one by the British government. Later on, after a few years, he becomes the Prime Minister of Israel. And later on, after a few years, he gets the Nobel Prize for Peace. Imagine, a person who has killed, a person who has killed hundreds and thousands of innocent human beings, becomes the Prime Minister of Israel and later on gets the Nobel Prize for Peace. And most of the groups that were fighting, like Stern Gang, Ignun, Haganah, all of these Jewish groups and the leaders, like Yatisak Fribin, Manikin Begin, Ariel Sharon, later on became Prime Ministers and high holding ranks in the State of Israel. And all of them, they were fighting for a Jewish state. If you see the world map, before 1945, Israel did not exist. Israel didn't exist. These Jewish groups, they were called as terrorists by the Britishers. They fought for a Jewish state. Later on, with power, they grabbed the land and they kicked the Palestinians out. And now these same people are calling the same Palestinians who are fighting for a more just cause, for getting the land back. And they are labeled today as terrorists by the Israelis.